Hello everyone. In this video, let's have a look at the official Android Nougat for the Moto X Style or the Moto X Pure. After a really, really, really long wait, we finally have the official Android 7.0 for our device. It has the Android security patch level from May 2017 and it is not the latest Android version. It is the Android 7.0 rather than 7.1.2 but that was expected. I got this OTA some time back and this update has launched worldwide. It hasn't come yet to all of the Moto X Pure and the Moto X Style but it has reached many of them. So you'll just have to wait if it does not show up in notification as an OTA. Just be patient, it should be there for you in a month or so at max. So let's have a look at the changes. Here is the system UI tuner which obviously you know you can enable by going let's just say first let me remove it then if you go here and press and hold this settings tile at the top system your tuner will be enabled got it here are some options to enable disable some things like battery percentage always show do not disturb and other you have some gestures power level notification controls there are and the usual goodies from nougat do come as well if you press and hold the recent button it enables multi window feature so that's really nice I've been missing this feature quite a lot let's move on to what else do we have there aren't really many customization features here. If I press here on edit, as you can see, I have some options to add all sort of stuff. Even data saver is there. That's a new good feature. What else is there? Storage. You can still use the feature to set up your memory card as internal storage. If you want to know how to do that, I'll be placing a link to that video in the description below. And talking about the battery life, the battery life has been pretty good here. I'm easily able to get around three and a half to four hours of screen downtime. So that's really nice. That is, I think according to my usage, at least 20 to 25% better than what, was, what I was getting on Marshmallow Room but usage for you may vary. All of the motor features work perfectly here. Motor voice, motor camera, twist for camera, toggle for torch. There are no issues there. The performance is pretty smooth too. There are no lags or stutters and even the heating has reduced with this update. That's nice to see. Another thing I would like to recommend to you, as you can see, there's also an option here. Press power button twice to open camera. So that's nice. SIM cards, that's obviously for dual SIM cards. So yeah, overall this is a pretty, pretty, pretty nice update. So what do you think about the Nougat update? Have you got it yet? Let me know your opinions in the comment section below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you and have a nice day.